welcome back to Ideology and Fiction, where we're going to be facing this boss. <laughs> I'm ready to proceed. Oh. Fuck, oh, look. Ah. Yeah, well, of course it's not very nice. I've been on it, tell me, I didn't want to come near me. Okay. I felt no emotion in his words. His face was shrouded by his black robes, but it looked like there is a twisted horror. ビルドイドってやつなのかしら。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。ええ。
Please! Don't touch her! I'll do whatever you want! So leave her alone! Okay. Hey, <laughs> got you! Hi! I give you three more seconds! That's it! Three! What the hell? Too bad! I eat the little shit! Oh, I just died. I'm expecting one of these guys to be freaking named Igor. <laughs> and the kid's dead. Demon bellowed, opened his mouth wide, and began to swallow the girl whole. It happened right as the demon was about to crush her bones. With his finger, with his fangs. And Blake came in to lop off this guy's head. Yo! Uh, that was a close one. After meeting back up with Blake at the village's entrance, we had a woman scream and ran here together. You fool! <laughs> You interrupted my the best parts. What do you mean? Interruption. <laughs> like exactly what you think it is. <laughs> Wait, did you do all this by me? <laughs> what do you mean? This I'm talking about all those dead elves. Tell me if uh, you're the one who killed them. Blake shouted with rage. <laughs> As you could tell. And, uh, no. <laughs> so that's what you're asking about. Is there some sort of problem with that? I didn't need the men, so I killed them. That's all. And you still call yourself human. Yes, I am a human. I want... I went for a medical examination recently. And a human was written on the results. Okay. We'll have to figure that out after this guy uh, carves you up. <laughs> Play... Blood vessels were swollen with his fury. The Prime Minister made a joke of everything he said. Uh, perfect! <laughs> I smothered the rage, rising like magma inside of me, and informed him of his fate. Wait! Look who rests me! Oh, you're nice! Are you here under hate's orders? Is that gonna be solved later? <laughs> None of that matters! We're talking about. We're taking you away! Gumble foe, peaceful! <laughs> What a waste of time! Uh, you trying? <laughs> no, it wouldn't be bad. I didn't realize I was dealing with children. I couldn't contain my laughter any longer. I felt like my gut was going to burst. There was no meaning in arresting me. Who do you think I am? Some random old fuck. <laughs> my options actually decent. Get to the point. I don't want to take care of that. See you too long. <laughs> There's no one alive who can punish me. My money and power are enough to make any case disappear. <laughs> Motherfucker! 
That's the only downside of facing uh, high ranking officials. I get it. <laughs> it seems you aren't foolish enough to act freely. <laughs> freely to emotion. Take one step forward and I'll kill someone else. Children, their mons mothers are watching, so I'll make their deaths extra cruel. Okay, now we know to carve up your body for later. <laughs> A part of a life, I'll freeze them and shatter their bodies. I drain, drive stones. Stakes through their hearts. I'll blow them apart from the inside. Uh, no. They're just an extension of me. <laughs> I was sure the man surrounding the children and the other women were all evil roids. Some was. Uh, uh, same with Flay. Just slow, and just slow, and uh, look like some sort of demon with tentacles. It doesn't need tentacles. <laughs> I don't want to know. There's too much thinking. <laughs> it, brilliant deduction. I have them developed all through the forest. They they follow my orders like pet dogs. Okay, yeah, now I know. The Prime Minister let out a low, creepy laughter. The Wood Elf children began crying, louder at his words. The women's faces went pale and their knees went weak. Well, someone needs to kill him. <laughs> Why are you getting so angry about something of this level? I've put children into giant blenders, baked them into meat buns, and fed them to their fathers. Okay. I have so many delightful memories. Well. Grab this elf and get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I didn't even know what to say anymore. This speech made the depths of my insanity clear. His happy face made me want to vomit. Okay, thank you, Kay. Blank's eyes were wide open. His face was pale and dropping with sweat. Couldn't believe what he was seeing was real. His jaw was clenched so tight, his gums were bleeding. His fists began to shake. Well, he isn't. Well, he he's actually gotten mad. <laughs> Me insane? From my perspective, you're the insane one. Power, wealth, influence, all lie within my grasp. I have the right to use all creation according to my own will. Well. We'll see about that, considering what it's just I pull. We're gonna freaking kill the Prime Minister. Don't tell me we are. We have to. <laughs> we need to. It was a no-win situation. How in the world were we... Were we... Supposed to save the Wood Elves? Okay. Well, this is a boss, I think. He said they followed his order. That just meant I had to kill him before he could get away. Give any. 
Shreds in an instant. Uh, yeah. You can do. I just wonder what what I should do to you two with you two. You fully understood our powerlessness. He's been smirking this entire time. You, the man. Throw that big sword onto the ground! Like, released his blade. Hmm. Prime Minister laughed again at his ob obedience. Now. Now! What do you do? What to do with, the el with you, elf woman? Oh, yes, I know! Uh, <laughs> thank God, I actually I was gonna be something bad. <laughs> thank God. If you don't want me to kill the children, then, then there you will be eaten by the devil rice and become their fuel instead. Nani. Okay, does this mean I need to kill? Smirk, sent a sh shiver down my spine. I never felt disdain quite like this before. Oh, oh dust. Close on now. <laughs> oh shit, that means this bitch is gonna be eaten. Fuck you. Time to fix this. I gave into his own into his fury and was about to approach the prime minister Dame. Eh. Come he already thrown away his sword he was defenseless the Elroids could kill him with their magic before he even knew what hit him <laughs> Youngsters nowadays are so bad at controlling their tempers. <laughs> Prime Minister was completely composed as he continued to insult Blake. Shit. Blake, go. I don't give a shit. Evilroids were ready to unleash their spells on Flake. He'd been, he'd been shivering with ra the rain of magic. If he took even one more step forward. What's the point? Have you thought of why I have a way out of this situation? I guess that's a no. No way I could think of something like that. I had no idea what I should do. Kill. I am not- I'm a strong enough- high enough level for this shit. I can at least survive at least a couple of strikes. 
What do I do, Clessy? Link stopped moving. Okay. <laughs> Women always think they can solve all their problems by crying. Disgusting. Okay. Leg shook me off with his strength. What the hell? He stood straight up in front of me. Flared in the Prime Minister's direction. Stop fucking crying about everything. Leg's words made my heart skip a beat. His back don't look the same as it did when he put his body in the line. Protect me from the, the tormentors when we were kids. He seemed so big. I know he had no fear. He wouldn't flinch back from anything he faced. Wave it to me. Okay. <laughs> Go through this. Leg broke into a run. You moved. Move. Tear the wood elves to shreds. Immediately. Obey my command. The Everoids all unleashed their magic. The magic together. He decides to say, fuck this! Like, de developed an impossibly strong magic barrier between the elves and the demons. Who the hell are you? No human can use magic, Pavlin, of the stuff by evil rights! It might have been even more impenetrable than Nerva's absolute defense spell, Phoenix. So, this is how it feels to cast the spell. And eh, whatever. I'll use whatever it takes to annihilate this scum. Huh. Main character powers activate. Let's do this. <laughs> Please tell me we get this use this, use freaking Blake at least once, like come on, this would be the perfect time. Keep attacking! Incredible! Annihilate him and the hostages alike! <laughs> Shoko, <laughs> out of my way. And the dead. During this encounter, I came to realize that the Everoids didn't have anything they could call emo they would call emotion. But now they were shaking with intense terror. Their hands and legs trembled with, with firm confusion. Leg just walked through the raging blast. The Everoids couldn't get close to him. He started straight, straight ahead at his prey. Where the hell are, are you fools looking at? Kill him! He's just a human boy! <laughs> they look at each other and like, oh fuck you shit. <laughs> the Everoids moved to block Blake's path. He's just saying fuck as he moves forward. <laughs> That's what I'm getting. I don't have any business with you, weasels. That one in the fucking bag <laughs> still looks like he's fucking screaming. The area was streamed with 
Dunks with me. They used to be evil Roy. Uh, only moments ago. The surviving the survivors flinched back. What the hell? Are you all afraid of? Your only value is in excitement. Exhausting is following my orders. By the time Flake reached the Prime Minister, every single Skivoroid has been consumed to obliteration, oblivion. Flake did not be stopped. He's like right there going, ah, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Someone, anyone, kill this bastard standing around. <laughs> Get to work. You just have to, have to gauge his heart out with a spell. It's so easy. Hemorrhoids have developed. He developed the guard. The Prime Minister came to fulfill the Prime Minister's orders. And an assault Flake. But Flake cannot be stopped. And he's like right there saying fuck it. The same barrier he used to the hostages. Stop the evil roids in their path. I heard rumors, but they cannot be true. Are you an executor? The fuck is this? The fuck is they? Alibi, no. Protect me, someone! I, you can at least become my shields! He compri his composure had vanished. Prime Minister decided, decided into a panic. Yeah, decided. It <laughs> Stay away from me! Who the hell I do you think I am? I'm the Prime Minister! Only the King is more important than me! You know what happened if you lay a finger on me! You would just be executed! All your thoughts, family members, and friends would die for your crimes! If you were to back down now, I would still consider pre uh, pretending you're, uh, you're for you. <laughs> and he just knocks his teeth in. Get him! And this is the best time to impale him. Flake bur buried his fist into the Prime Minister's face. Harold flew back into the bush, in the bush, slammed against a massive tree at high speed. You don't have the right to live, to live in this world. Die. <laughs> <laughs> Tears filled uh, fall, fall from uh, his eyes like waterfalls, the blood gushing from his nose. I'm also gonna drop the sound a little bit because, dear God, it is freaking loud. There we go. Now it's a little bit quieter. Now we don't need to worry about it too much. My jaw kill me. Give me please There's some healing I can now He was trying to scream something, but no one could understand what he was saying. With his jaw shattered. His desperate cries for help didn't even reach his uh, only allies, the evil Roy. Lord, protect me! Evil rides, join me now! 
Kept screaming. Unintelligibly. What's that? Damn you! Fuck you, bye! Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him! His fear and determination finally drove him to, com to communication a single command. Every remaining Eloroid committed a final assault on Flay. And I'm betting they all died. The magic all converged on Flake at once. I can only see white smoke where he was standing. Even Flake, incredible barriers, could not hope to stand up to that many attacks at once. <laughs> That's right. Not even bones would remain after that attack. Like that. I couldn't stand it any longer. I collapsed to the ground. Is he a demon lord? <laughs> what the hell is that? When the smoke cleared, it, re re it revealed an elf with light, black skin, sharp horns, and jet black wings. Did he get a freaking full of fucking anime power up? What the fuck? He definitely has made a character in the G. Hell yeah! <laughs> I even freaking called it too. Please tell me he can join my team. <laughs> what is happening? God damn it! I didn't even know this part till now. Like holy shit! Please go on. <laughs> Look like an entirely different person. I don't care. Wait, can he join my team? He has power ups. Fucking finally. But for some reason, I was absolutely certain it was Flake. Well, at least we know he has magic power. Flake was supposed to be an ordinary human. He couldn't even use. You mean. use magic? That's us magic. Where did all this magic, magical energy come from? And yet, now he's supposed to be, power, be a powerful elf mage. A, a moundless baddie. There's no way. It must be a sacrifice. Ex sacrifice. Accept me. Become your master's destiny. And those who give up your perception. So those who decided fled. Oh, only those who accept, escape survive. When the weak come together. They are unstoppable. The songs of the heavens come their application, foundation, activate. And Flake unleashed his immense power. Evoroids were transformed into, me into motes of light. One by one, they all vanished into, thin into the air. Now I know he has a freaking strap power boost. And not a 10. <laughs> Blake looked at his hand, ignoring the surrounding his surroundings, while his power rampaged around him. Gonna go right it right to him! <laughs> the surviving Eloroids raised their magic down on Flake. Please tell me he grabs his sword and becomes an even more of a badass, like, come on. <laughs> but Flake casually blocked them with a single hand. And die! 
Link began annihilating the evil Lorik with awesome speed. Well, shit. My body is so wet. Link's incredible speed increased. I could barely track him with my eyes. With Link's uh, massacre, the evil Roid, as easily as a, as a child destroying, child destroying sand castle. I can't restrain my power. Link looked back at me for a second. I haven't seen that look on your face since uh, you were a kid. This is his. He distracted his piercing gaze towards the enemy. His eyes were the same as when he protected me from those bullies back then. Shit! You, you were you were a mere knight. How dare you disobey me? Somebody, anybody, kill him now! I mean, this episode's gonna be Link getting a power boost. The episode. <laughs> hey, should I say something? I can't think of the way. I guess it doesn't matter. I was just one kill this son of a bitch. I can't allow him to live. Somebody! Please save me! I'll give you all the money I have to save my life. Nah. Run up and just impaled. <laughs> he collapsed and tried to crawl to the evil roid in the corpse, begging for salvation. Got it, hell. Link unleashed his power upon the Prime Minister. The area where the Prime Minister had been a minute ago, earlier had become a giant hole in the ground. And then this guy jumps in! Well, if I was scared, what if from then I'd be headed straight to hell? Large Elf had the, un the unconscious Prime Minister in his, in his arms. And was looking around. He must have picked a, picked him up before Flake's attack struck. He was here in the middle of the battle, and saved the prime minister. He was no ordinary man. Give me that! Give me that scumbag! Hey, this is a gift. This is a gift. That my extremely precious stubbornness asked me for. They'd get, they got mad at me if I broke it. Yeah, uh, my name's Lavish. Uh, though I'm surprised this is uh, no time for a friendly chat. Don't tell me that Blake is a goddamn demon lord this entire time. <laughs> what? What the fuck is wrong with you? Stay out of my way! I gotta kill this motherfucker for screwing the fuck up! <laughs> Come now. There's no need to glare at me like that. I'm just bad. I'm just about pissing myself. Fuck ass. Every. Hey, calm down, dude. Please, just relax. Chill out. <laughs> sorry, I'm really sorry. Just let me explain myself, okay? Hey. Blake chopped his lounge into a gaze, raising his face. What? You got me with your hand. Holy shit! 
you're one tough customer. And yeah, he's like, add like a little cut. <laughs> Give me something tough, leader. I'm in a deep city. The werecat is he called Lita. She ended a spell. At, at least slow him down? The magical barrier enveloped us and the wood elf. Nice! Good girl! You did it! Okay. Uh, yes. I don't fucking know it either. <laughs> that was the incantation from Felix, but it was completely different from the one Minerva used. I've never seen defensive magic like this before. She's pretty special. Wait. Guess I can't let down my guard yet. Not, not that there's anything I can do against him. I guess I leave the younglings with the youngling. Well, young Alexis. Le to me, at least. Nope. A smirking elf woman appeared. They were the same elf and werecat duo that I had met with before. Okay. Out of my way, you fool! My gig is in! Like he ascended? This is what happens when your power consumes you? That's not a bad option! The woman they call they were calling Monica stood directly in front of Flay. Uh, don't do it. Okay, at least we know she's tough. <laughs> Besides, she's the only one of us who can do anything. You'd be turned to dust in a flash if you got between them. You just don't have what it takes. Activate. Yeah, Monica and the and that dude both ascended, but unlike him, she can activate it. Free, she can actually freely control it. Let me teach you something interesting, Clasier. Uh, how did you know my name? Never introduced myself. This is like the best time to kind of end the episode. <laughs> this episode's pretty freaking long. Believe me, I have not edited this once. I did not edit this at all. Like, future me can agree to this. I haven't even touched the freaking editing board yet. <laughs> this is all one cut, by the way. It's like 40, uh, like 45, no, 44 and a half minutes. So, I hope all you guys have a great all the time. Great day, too. And I'm going to question what the fuck I'm going to do. At least we know what next episode's going to be. See you guys next time.